This morning, Livecopter 3, Sacramento's only news helicopter, captured this video of a brush fire in Hagenwood Park. This is in North Sacramento. It is just a preview of what we could see in the next few months as temperatures rise. And now it's the time to make sure that you are prepared. KCRE 3's Leticia Ordaz live outside at that park with more on the brush fire and concerns for this wildfire season. Leticia, good morning. Ready and Mike, good morning. We can tell you that fire is now out here at Hagenwood Park. Crews worked very quickly to put that fire out, but it's just a reminder of the fire season that we are going to have. Uh, take a look at the fuel that is out here. A lot of growth because of the rain we've been experiencing, and that is another concern because officials say because of the wet weather, it may not be top of mind for a lot of people, but fire season is coming, and they say make no mistake, there is more fuel to burn. The training comes as temperatures heat up this week and the dangers rise in our region already this weekend. Crews responded to a number of grass fires like the one that we saw today. This weekend preparedness was also top of mind in the foothills. There was a big fire awareness event in the city of Auburn to get homeowners ready for the summer months and Auburn's fire chief says now is the time to start taking necessary steps to strengthen defensible space around our home. If we can have a zone of no flammable material around the home for that first five feet, the chances of your home surviving is significantly increased. For us in the city of Auburn, it's not if the fire will come, it's when the fire will come. And what we've determined is that uh, when the fire comes, if you can do your defensible space and provide that barrier, uh, the, the likelihood of the home igniting becomes significantly less. And officials say have that bag ready to go. So often people don't have a bag ready, so they're sticking around scrambling, looking for those important documents. Have your bag. That way when you're told to evacuate, you can just get yourself out the door safely.